Did I tell you what Councillor Murray said to me when she gave me this medal? Yes. Trigger, you are boring the pants off me with this bloody <laughs> medal. No. She said, I thank you on behalf of the council and the people of Peckham. <laughs> Morning, Sid. What do you fancy, brothers? Uh, I have a cheese roll. One cheese roll. I still find it hard to believe. So do I. Medals for road sweepers? Good God, they'll be giving Del Boy an award for good taste next. Not you know. Boy, Del. Thank God you've arrived. He could bore you two with it now. What's that? Trigger's got a medal. Oh, yeah. Where'd you find that then, Trick? No, I was awarded it. Look. It's a picture of me receiving my medal from Councillor Murray. See? That's me. Oh, that's you. Well, I'm glad you cleared that up. Here, you have a look at that mini trick, will you? Oh, right. So that's that Councillor Murray, is it? She's the old cow that refused my application for a council grant. I've been so humiliated in my life. Uh, Derek, when you have the time, you must tell me all about it. Do you mean some of your friends down at the Masonic Lodge have got influence in the town hall? Uh, no. It's just that I've often wondered what it must be like to apply for a council grant. <laughs> <laughs> and the day started off so well, didn't it? Huh? It's Councillor Murray's idea. She's head of finance and facilities at the town hall. And she says that local people should be rewarded for services to the community. A proud moment in my family's history. Trigger. You haven't got a family history. You were created by a chemical spillage at a germ warfare factory somewhere off the depths of Hoth. Maybe, but I still feel proud. <laughs> so what exactly is the award for? For saving the council money. I am to mention to her one day that I've had the same broom for the last 20 years. She was very impressed and said, have a medal. 20 years. It's a long time, Dave. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Well, that's two decades, isn't it? I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> uh, Tree, just, just a second. If you've had that broom for 20 years, have you actually swept any roads with it? Well, of course. But I look after it well. We have an old saying that's been handed down by generations of road sweepers. Look after your broom. Did your broom will look after you? <laughs> No, Dave. It's just look after your broom. <laughs> well, that also. Yeah, and that's what I've done. I've maintained it for 20 years. This old broom has had 17 new heads and 14 new handles in its time. <laughs> Can it be the same bloody broom? Well, here's a picture of it. What more proof do you need? 